talking tea with Tika and your girl Tika. We did get a little bit of a late start, uh, but that's all right, we're all here now. Uh, we have a nice full room of tea sippers. If you didn't know you were officially a tea sipper, you have now become a tea sipper. So today, we want to tell everybody thank you, thank you, thank you for your support. I love you all. You already know that. I tell y'all all the time. I love y'all so much. So thank you for the ongoing support. Today's topic, Facebook, is weekend hookups and dating on the stepping scene. Oh my God. Now, my lovely panel that I have with me today, you know, they need no introduction, actually, but I'll go ahead and let them introduce themselves. How about that? Start on the end over there. It's your boy. Like Taye say, this set is hell, y'all, straight out of the door. What? Yeah. Is that English? <laughs> I don't know what you said. Say that again. <laughs> I said, stop taking all the table up. <laughs> so oh, I heard that. Okay. <laughs> Good afternoon, I'm Maddie B. First name Maddie B. Last name out of Chicago. <laughs> We're gonna keep this grown and live. How about that? Yeah, we're gonna keep it grown and live. It's your boy DJ Candy Man. Oh, yeah. Bringing up the real but never slacking. You understand what I'm saying? It's your boy. Yeah, we here. And I'm gonna tell you the truth. Whether you like it or not, you better be ready for it. Let's get it. Alright, y'all, let's go ahead and get this grown and sexy conversation started. So I think we should start with the dating on the stepping scene. So what I'm going to say is my opinion is this. So what I need to also put this disclaimer out first. I know you guys know that I am married to DJ Kanzanian, but today I am pulling into my single roots. I like that. I can do when that. When I was single. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Do so, people which, pay? Do what you say. Ain't nothing personal, right? Ain't nothing personal. Not at all. Right? Yeah. But y'all see them later, not even speaking, y'all know what Y'all already have this conversation up in the That's right. a disclaimer, too. Keep that in mind. So I'm not talking from a girl that's married. I'm talking from a girl that I'll was single. I'll leave you for Maddie B, though. And I did well. Oh, see, see what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm not talking about Maddie B. Yeah, I'm talking about Maddie B. Alright, so what we're going to start with, we're going to start with the first part of dating on the stepping scene. Now, here's my situation. If I was single and dating on the stepping scene, I would do it. I would do it. I would commit really to anyone. I would make sure I tell the truth. You understand what I'm saying? It is what it is. You're just the flavor of today. So I think the, the, the truth, you just have to tell the truth. Now, what I'm understanding is that most men that play this field be lying. Yeah. And that's what I think is. Yes. They lie. What you lying for? Uh uh, y'all be talking ain't like this. They lie. Why you gotta lie? If it is, it is what it is, right, ladies? What my ladies step? Y'all get up one time and snap up. One time. All right, are you ready for a second opinion on this diagnosis? of dating and stepping. I'm going to tell you what the candy man sees and the candy man knows for real. Y'all women outnumber us at least 14 to 1 in okay. stepping. Okay. So when I, when, I, when I tell you that a man doesn't have to lie to kick it with you, if I miss with you, I got 13 more options. You understand what I'm saying? It's going to be somebody out there that's going to love what the candy man is giving to us. And if you get good with it, then you Stop. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, okay, so, man, so are you saying that there's a lot of community dick around? Absolutely. Absolutely. See, see what y'all don't understand is a man, a, man, a man can sleep with you and leave a hundred dollars on the counter and not think about you. Don't know your name, what's your last name, or where you come from. Know? Not your city or your color. You understand what I'm saying? I got what I had to get that. The Hennessy told me to do it. And I did. Wait a minute. You don't, you don't blame it on the alcohol. I, 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 Absolutely. Oh my God. I, man, that's the lamest excuse in the world. Well, Maddie B, 
it would be if I hadn't been who I am and came to that scene. You know, I'm a late night guy. You know, I like the street lights at night. So I see people creeping. And I can tell you who been creeping out there in these hotels from the Harrison Bar to the Black and Green to the All White right Party. I see you out there creeping and you going to get what you got to get. They ain't thinking about no lifetime love. They thinking about tonight. Get I am speechless with what you just said. Wait, I know it's true, but I'm just saying it leaves me speechless that somebody was actually willing to say that. Oh, I've seen people in the park and not giving love. You understand what I'm saying? Oh, wait, wait. So, if you're going to be real, I'm going to be real. We got somebody up there in the back. So, you know, listen to what they're saying. Come on, Diva, come on. Well, first of all, I'm from, I'm from the heart, not the dark. So at the start, do you have the heart? Okay. Uh -oh. <laughs> Is that directed to me? Is that directed to me? I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna say. I'll tell you any treasure that's gonna pleasure your mind, but all I want is what's between. You understand what I'm saying? A real player is gonna tell you what's gonna make you smile, but he knows what's gonna get you in the sheets. <laughs> Are the sheets clean, Kirsten? Are the sheets? That's the sheets. It's your sheets. It has to be a sheet. It's your sheets, so you don't know if they clean or not. I'm not going to bring you to my place, but I don't need you to go where I stay. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to your So if your sheets are clean, then you know them. Okay, so we talking a lot of shit. Let me going around with Stephenson. So it's hard to have dirty dick and clean sheets. I don't think it's going to be terrible. So the people that can't be in my way. I'll tell you, Madam B. Is that the line? I'll tell you, Madam B. You're absolutely correct. You're absolutely correct, but like I said in the beginning, y'all, our number is 14 to 1. Yeah, but you ain't got to eat on every place you see on the table. Number 8 is not going to know that it's dirty. She's just going to oh, see that you're a good dancer, that your eight steps is good, that your four is not hard, and you gave her a move that she's never seen before. So she's going to go to sleep with you. You understand what I'm saying? I know plenty of players in the stepping community that don't have a job and still got a woman. You understand what I'm saying? Did you see all the lace that was in the building last night? They was giving it to you. They were showing it to you. Clean your ass, everything. You know, they were giving it to you. There was some TNA going on, but there were still some ladies that were dressed appropriately, that wasn't rubbing all up on you, trying to see what you was, whether you had some drawers on or not, to see what your print was and all that other kind of stuff. Now, now. There were some ladies there, and guess what, Candyman? They probably didn't get a dance until we got up to that day. Now, now, Matty B, now, Matty B, to a gentleman. Yeah. <laughs> to a gentleman, to a gentleman that would be intriguing, but to a player, that's not, that's not what, if you are a lady and you're sitting there all refined, I'm going to go to the 13 more, that's not. There was a lot of them out there that they had. They had oh they, they, did you see when the, Shut when, when, when Meyer and all played the booty songs, how they was dropping and spreading, that's what you want. Oh, I dropped you too. No, 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 Now, Matty, me and what I'm trying to say to you, to a, to a, to a player, see, when y'all said y'all was hot, 
all y'all refined them and y'all was hot and y'all said I've danced enough and I'm going on back to the room for to, to tomorrow. There was some people there that night that liked the house music that was dropping it, they'll give it to you right then. So to a player, to a real G that's out there trying to get it, he'll wait for the end to y'all to be out. Be patient, see? That's a G, be patient. Y'all hear me? I'll wait for to read out and then I'll show. That's my man, bro. Oh, y'all let him have a flow. That's my man, bro. Give him the flow. Give him the flow. Let me sit for a little time on that. Y'all heard it. Don't think he lying. Y'all heard but listen, I have to say this for some of the guys. We do respect the women that's, you know, about the heart, just like you said. But then y'all probably be 14. So about y'all be number 14. <laughs> oh, so, so if one through thirteen turn you down, then you just gonna go to the respectable. Like, we're, we're gonna start Maddie, talking about the heart too, mad at me. Since, no, no, since my wife said that, you know, the single talk. That's not your wife. The single talk. That's not your wife. I'll never, I'll never lose fourteen times. You can be the key. The key is gonna strike. I'm gonna strike the third time. Guaranteed. guarantee. You know, that's guaranteed. So the it's third like time, I got you. I you know, you ever seen a show with the shrimps? No, it's <laughs> the boat where they throw the shrimps the out, the net out, and hope Debbie is catch. <laughs> so he done caught 13 of them, number 14, they threw back. See, what y'all women ain't, ain't seem to realize Kenny that. Man, you can't take over this whole Damn conversation <laughs> with your pimp tone. <laughs> you know, I need you. Is to 
And I mean, this is just my personal opinion. But attention that you never got. Yeah. 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 If it's that cat that a woman ain't never looked at her, right. and all he got to do is go out there and hold her hand and dance with her, and he got him some attention. That's really what it's all about. Right. Yeah, but it's some women out there that the cats ain't never looked at either. That get the same attention from everybody. Let me, let me, let me, let me piggyback off what Sally Sales said. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Because Candyman has always promised to tell you the real. A man ain't going to ask you to dance unless he's attracted to you. He's going to come to you and you to dance. So, for real, you, you can say all oh, and do all you want to. If a man ain't attracted to you, you better ask him to dance because he ain't going to ask you. You know what I'm saying? It's real. We got to go. We have a whole lot of people that are going to be here for a while. Y'all got to go. 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 Y'all Yes, I have a question and a statement. Okay. I don't know if we're talking about dating or we're talking about hoeing prostitutes. Yeah. Oh. I mean, Same thing. Oh. <laughs> Go to church. Go to the grocery store. Go to something else. Let me explain. Let me explain to what I'm saying. What I'm saying to you is this is a club scene and this stepping thing was built on pimping. You understand what I'm saying? It was a pimp thing and it was a hustle thing. So nothing, nothing can break the, the, the fabric of what this stepping was. So when you bring players and you bring ex-cons and ex-junkies to this game, they're not out there trying to find no relationship. They're trying to find this right now, tonight. If you want to get a relationship and fall in love, you need to go to church. That's not true, man. That is not true. I mean, you, if you've been to Chicago, hands of those have been to Chicago. You know, so they have some. Bishop Don Juan here. is the best walk I've ever seen. And he's a Can you that When I went to the East of the Rhine, it wasn't ever pimps, man. You know? It wasn't ever pimps, man. It was pimps. So you got to be done If you're going to talk about Chicago, talk about it. Talk about it. It was pimps in the East of the Rhine. Baby, is that the only place you went when you went to Chicago? I went to the I went to the Blue Nut. It was pimps.
Now, you deal with dating on the scene, you deal with those that are long distance. I'm not dealing with nobody local because I know what's going on locally. Okay, like y'all said, we know. But I think I'm going to get off this mic right now. You did good, thank you. Bring y'all back in on what we talked about is dating in the community. Y'all know what you Okay, and so wait, let me let me respond to that. You're absolutely correct. Um, again, everybody wants someone. You know, I don't care where you are, what you're doing. You know, even from little children, they tell you if kids aren't touched at a certain age, there is some kind of deficiency in them. So everybody wants that, but everybody ain't looking for sex. You know, they don't. Everybody ain't trying to. Hook up. There are some that are. You heard it from the horse's mouth. There are some women that are. You know, some of them is just as bad as the men. You know, they hook up more than the men do. But there are someone, people that are genuinely lonely and are looking for a companion. Now, he should get touch you when she said that. Don't like that. Why are you so sensitive today? Anyway, but so so go ahead, sir. Go what ahead, is your sir. name? My name is Clarence. I'm from Gary, Indiana. Gary, that's right across the street from me. Shout out to Gary. But like Michael you Jackson, said, as far as relationship, there's nothing wrong with dating on the scene, being in a relationship. But if you met that person on the seventh scene, that's part of their life. If you met someone bowling, skating, that's part of them. So as a man or a woman, you have to accept that. But the main thing is you have to be confident in yourself. Yeah. If you have you have low self-esteem, no self-worth, yes, guys are very disrespectful on the scene, same way with the women. He knows what he's doing. Like I said, you be out there sitting right here and a nigga come up, come on little stance. And you're like, whoa, nigga, don't you see? <laughs> but it's the same way. You got to check them. It's the same way with the women. When right. you come by, you dancing, and you give a simple dance, whatever, then they all extra with it and such and such. Because a woman can see that your woman's getting upset. Some women's going to be like, oh, I'm going to put a little extra. Because they see she getting pissed off. Right. Don't give it with the guys. You, yeah. you doing it, you stepping with her, you may do have to do certain type of moves. This guy come along and say, well, shit, I have her doing this and this and that. Then he looking at you and say, nigga, you can't make her do this like I do. Oh, wow. So it's a lot of disrespect. But at the end of the day, you have to be secure with yourself yeah, and what you're making. Yeah, that's awesome. Absolutely. And the other thing is that. Can I respond like that again? Can I say something? Oh, 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 Um, this is whatever it is, a little more survival, right? Most, most of the people in this stupid community are grown ass men and women, right? We, we are grown, we've we been divorced and been through stuff and drugs and alcohol. I mean, for real, I mean, for real, this ain't no joke, all right? This is for real. There's a lot of people right here who find stepping as a way out of where they work. You understand what I'm saying? So we, we, we it, when it comes to relationships and stuff, man, if I'm out here and I'm having a good time and we drinking and the night is what it is, it is what it is. I'm not looking for no relationship. I'm not looking for no love. Now, 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 wait a minute, now, wait a minute, now, wait a minute. If you just happen, if you just so happen, if you just so happen to find love, if you just so happen to find love in this deputy community, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. But I, I, I know for a fact that this is not the spot for that, man. It is. It is. If you so happen to find that, that's, I've seen people in the deputy community, and I don't want to call, like you said, we want to call no names. Thank you. But everybody knows people who have left. Oh, she was with this guy. Oh, he was with this guy. Oh, that's her ex-wife. This is her ex -wife. And they still, they, 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 they came in the step of community as together, but then as the things came to do, you're not bringing me happiness. I'm not having to say this dance and not your dance. And I'm not. All right, we got somebody at the mic. Go ahead and say it. Uh, say something, because I got a headache. Yeah, I got a headache. So we add some vodka. Oh! 
Oh, my name is Arsul. My name is Arsul from LA. We're from Chicago What's up, as well. Um, you said one I think he just had the title page. I'm sorry. It's not everybody. Oh, no, we ain't trying. We, he can have all the pictures so, in the world, but let's hear yours. Yeah, I got into something actually about five years ago because, number one, I did want, always wanted to learn to dance with my mom and dad box. And then I like to try my part of it. So that's what it's doing for me. I don't really get here. I didn't get in. It's like, oh, that's a, that's a whole bunch of women here. Because I can see, catch somebody at Target or Walmart. And that kind of right. Right. I don't have to come yes, Now, I did with the dating scene. I've done it a couple of times. with the respect thing the brother just talked about. Uh, I've talked to some women that I have brought into stepping. I've said, I have to watch out for. Okay. Certain hand gestures, all this stuff you have to watch for men. Mm -hmm. Or somebody stepping. How to respect the dance in the relationship, like the like brother said, even from walking. Like, if she's been dancing and I'm in her step, and all of she likes to walk. Now, if she still don't like the guy put all on her like that, and I'm sitting at the damn table from the back, well, we just got to keep that little arm extended. So are we talking about your girlfriend walking with somebody else? No, we just talking about you talking about dating and stepping, right? So your date is walking with somebody else? Talk to him, brother. You understand the way I come from. Talk yeah. to him. But I, I, if that's her thing, I don't have a problem with her walking. But I do how I think, just like a, uh, in the dance, a woman know how to push the guy back if she feels something. And it's the same way. So that's, I'm just using walking as an okay, example. Okay, I got you. Or okay. even dipping her ass. I'm like, wait a minute, mom. You didn't dip your yeah. day? Yeah. Hey. 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 I mean, hey. both feet on the floor. Both feet. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just keep going. Every time you say something, I'm just saying, I mean, is it okay? Or my one? Right. I have to check her and the dude sometimes. So that's what I'm just saying with respect part of the day. And then it's trying to make it seem like. Well, he need just because he told you not to let that guy dip you, really? You know, so what's wrong with a dip? What's wrong with them? They, they better keep both of your feet on the floor. I know that. I'm saying a lot in these streets. What's wrong with a dip? I don't understand right. that. So if I, dip, if, I, if I dip somebody, you're going to be all right with yeah. that? Yeah. Don't give me candy, man. I'm going to dip you, man. I'm going to show I, I have a no dip zone in my area. In my time and space, no dipping. Them long legs, you could to get at least a a a a a, a ninety degree angle. <laughs> I didn't introduce myself first half because y'all all know me, but well, I'm, I'm, I'm Brian, I don't know I'm Brian San Antonio. Uh -huh. By the way, I want to make sure we you know, make sure everybody understands San Antonio is in the building. Yep, yep. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I got I got one I got a statement and a question. My wife and I, Poppy, Bradley Forbes over here. We've been married for going on twenty eight years. Raise your hand, Poppy. Oh, like, oh, oh, oh. Now I won't say this. In insecurity is not even in my wheelhouse whatsoever. Okay. I like it when my wife gets the opportunity to dance with a man that's capable, that can take her on the floor and do things where she enjoys her dance. I got no trick whatsoever. Okay? It's just a real man. Say that different. You say that and, and so I say that to say that when you have a security in your relationship, this is a dance. And I'm going to be honest with you. When I'm out there dancing with a female, we got three minutes, baby. Yeah. I got three minutes to romance you a little bit. That's right. Make you feel some kind of way. That's right. And hopefully make you want to dance with me again. That's the right. Time. And I expect every man to dance with my wife to be the same way. But but beyond that, you know, and she know how to handle you. I was going to say, wife, right, right. come up here to this mic. Why is your, your face looking like that? Why is your face looking like that? It's only three and a half minutes. Here's my, here's my question though, when, it comes, when it comes to dating on this step of scene, this is this is my question because I've seen this too. How many times do you date somebody on a step of scene before you start looking like community dick all over? Because let me tell you something, people honestly go into these relationships with good intentions. They do. But they end up falling out with a person, and then it's like, okay, well, I'm back on the market, and the next cat step up, Ooh. and he swoop up. Then it's like, well, that didn't work out. So yeah. the next guy, because we enjoy this dance so much, there's people within the dance that want to be like, hey, look, you know what? I know you was with old boy and old boy, but look here. Come on, holler at me. 
How many times do you do this? And in what period of time before you start looking like a hug? Or before you start looking like a million man? That, that, that is the confusion of being business for life or business right now. Family, you don't have nothing to say yet. I've been dreaming about that. Family, what's going on? Family, I'm telling the truth. Okay, so let me say something to that. That is absolutely correct. However, a lot of times, and I've seen it over the years, because I've been stepping for years and years. <laughs> probably, probably longer than some of you all have been born. But the bottom line is, you know, you have a relationship. Everything was going, you could have even been living together or whatever, and for whatever, ha whatever reason, it didn't work. So now, is she... Well, he went and found somebody else to dance, but I want you to know that. That night, if you put his ass out that night, she came and picked his shit up and took it to her house. You see that, you know, and I mean, you're really dating, so we're talking about still dating, right? And so she now is, has to see you, because y'all still in the same circle. She got to see you waltzing around with Miss Thing right here. The same thing that... He didn't have no job, as Candyman said. And so I took him in because I thought he had potential. Not that he was 45 or 50, and if he had potential, he would have showed it at 25 or 30. Right. And so somebody just scooped him up. And your first thought is, well, she could have his broke ass. <laughs> you know? But you done bought him some cologne. And so she wouldn't have said nothing to him. She wouldn't have. You gave her a rap for your man because the first thing when he bring it in, she gonna say, oh, you smell good. What? Right? That's the cologne I bought. So leave that nigga in the, um, what's the name of that cologne? With the brown uh, thing on the Old Spice. Leave him with the Old Spice, baby. Because as soon as you give him some of that other stuff, somebody gonna stop him and say, oh, you smell good. That's a conversation for your man. Go ahead. Go ahead. To answer you, the reason I was looking at right that. Okay, all right, quite a Say your name. My name is Desiree from Atlanta. Oh, What's up? Woo, woo. ATL. Yes, ATL. The reason I was looking like that is because I'm somewhat new in the community, so this is different for me because when I would go out with my mate, that's the only person I danced with, unless it was a friend or a family member. Right. But when you go out to a club, you dance with your mate all night long. You're right. not dancing with anybody else, right. neither are you. Right. So here, watching other, I'm like, is he, is he married? Did he just, right. he slide her down his leg? Yeah. So that, that yeah, some of so I thought, yeah. I thought it, it was the norm, and I said that I wouldn't be participating. Um, so now this is good for me to hear that it's somewhat not. It ain't. It ain't. Don't listen to them with that bullshit. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. That ain't normal. All right. All right. You know that it made. Candy man ain't gonna say something else. Candy man ain't gonna say something else. Candy man ain't gonna say something else. That ain't. Yeah. You see when you that look on your face, you can be responsible for what come out your mouth. But sometimes that look on your face you can't be responsible for. Right. So you hear that shit and you saying, I don't really want to participate in that. Go ahead, Kendra. All right. I, I, I'm going to try to be real. And I hope y'all follow me on this one. Uh, as a male coming into this Does anybody state, have some time to <laughs> As a male, as a male coming into stepping, the first thing my instructor told me that the dance is like having sex. And you only got three minutes. So you want to give them the best three minutes of their life. But that and was an they, analogy. Well, well, that wasn't for you to grind on the name that's long. I know that. I know that, Maddie. We got songs. I know that, too. But listen to me. That was an analogy. But listen to me and where I'm going. An analogy. My instructor. My instructor told me that this dance was like having sex and you have three minutes. So for a man. Not for a woman, for a man, that means we're gonna try to give you the best dance that we got in those three minutes. You ain't got to pull your okay. dick out. Now, now, it's not all the ways, Maddie B, it's not about us pulling our dick out. You understand what I'm saying? A man, I mean, never, a, 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 a man, a, a man, and it's just as a man, and I'm talking for real, this is not an analogy. A man is never gonna pull his dick out unless he get the eye from a woman that it's okay to pull my dick out. 
You know what I'm saying? So so if you dance with them for that three minutes and you have given them the best dance that they've ever had, they're going to flop it open for you. Okay? So now, now, now. now, 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 now well, I mean, the legs open up. You got to... They ain't gotta flop over for you to get okay, in. Okay, wait a minute. Unless you go in from there. Hold on. Oh, is this an analogy or are you talking about real life? No, 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 no. no. I'm, I'm, I'm talking about the analogy and the realistic. That's at the same real. Time. What? Because this is what I've seen out there, Maddie P. Now, now, everybody know that Candy Man is married to see later. There ain't nothing a woman can do to get me from her oh, except for you, Maddie P. Oh, <laughs> what, 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 what I'm saying, what I'm saying is. <laughs> You got you got you got people out there who are really looking for a relationship. They're looking for love, but they don't. They, they they get a dance from somebody who can dance, and they fall in love. No, they were damaged before they got. Okay, that's right. And, that, and that's true. They were damaged before that, but they found they they, they put their investments. If if you invest in something, you understand what I'm saying. They invested okay. in the wrong okay, thing. Okay, so hold on. Um. um. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Tiffany, I got something to say. Your name and your name. Yeah, it's the liquor, right? It's the liquor. Yeah, I'm getting Tiffany. Talk to him, Tiffany. You're right, bro. I know you know what it is. I'm just making a point. I'm just saying, this is looking at it from a business standpoint. Okay, I'm just saying. Yeah, I'm just saying. 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 No, nah, seriously, um, when I came onto the scene, they roll at us after night. Tell the truth now. I'm, go. I'm just going to tell the truth. When I came onto the seventh scene about five years ago, it was my brother that brought me into the seventh scene, okay? I ain't know nothing. I came out. I was watching. I looked at it. I fell in love with it. Then I started DJing for it, right? And then I was like, yeah, I might find a girl out here because I was just recently divorced. I might find a girl. There's a lot but of But you get right? a lot of pussy being a DJ. Not you? necessarily. <laughs> not that shit ain't true. Come on in there, Oh, that's so you got okay, well, See, that's that's a that, I don't know. That's a myth. That shit does not happen. Okay, <laughs> I'm just letting you. I'm just letting you know. Y'all think that shit happened? That that does mess up relationships for a DJ because they think that's what's going on. So who's so, all oh. them women that be standing on the stage next to y'all? They didn't buy no table, man. To be, they didn't get no table. They need a seat. So you know the deal, but what I'm saying is, when I started to become a DJ for the situation, I was thinking at first, recently divorced, yes, I might find somebody within the community. But as I started to DJ more and more, and I started seeing things in the Stephen community, I said, hell no, I'm not going to date nobody. I don't nobody. want none of that. Right, because it might be a bad business decision for uh -huh. me. I see what you're saying. You understand what I'm saying? You smile and you look, DJ. I appreciate you. You really you look smart. You know so, what? And that's true because even as a party promoter, you know, there are certain things you want to sit on a panel and talk about, and then there are certain things you don't because you don't want people to get mad about your opinion. You, you know, right. your First Amendment right. So, so I say it's a bad bit. It's not saying that I don't talk to females in the Stephen Curry. I don't oh, give you that conversation. You ain't never got no man. No. Come on, Stephen. I don't want to tell us to you, Mom. Spray. How long you been DJing? Five years. Somebody told us to do So he's been selling it for five years too. Hold on, hold on, wait a minute. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Damn that. Come on now. Damn that. 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 Damn Want to sleep with anybody or, or get he in the air? Uh, uh, no, no, no. He says, he wants to sleep with somebody. That man, yeah, let me tell you, I know Samson Knight. He's been through oh, enough oh, shit with women. Samsonite. Okay, he's been through enough shit with women where sleeping with you is not going to satisfy me. I don't want to have to pay no alimony or no child support or none of that kind of shit, right? So, 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 so this is what. Well, I'm trying to tell you what men think. Okay, see, because y'all don't understand. Okay, come on, we have somebody else. I don't finish. 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 I don't fin
I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna finish, and then it's, it's not gonna be long. A man, a man who knows this does not go to a stepping set looking for a relationship because he knows he knows that when he get into a relationship, all this other stuff comes into play. Are you gonna be all right with me? Are we gonna do this? If we have a child, are we gonna have this? If we get married, it's gonna have this. If you've already been through some drama, you're not looking to get into no more drama. When I get into it with you, this is gonna be a dance. We're gonna live like this forever. This is gonna be our thing. But stepping is not like that. Stepping is a way of life. If you don't love it, if you don't want to dance, if you don't want to do your thing, Man. it's not going to Okay. Thank you for those comments. Thank you. This is our last comment. Unfortunately, y'all, this is our last comment for the day. Well, she got to come out of church. She can't be credible. <laughs> Right quick. Go ahead. I think the best thing he said tonight, one of them, was what Samson and I was talking about. The big perception. So the one thing for sure for the men, the ladies and people may see that certain men get a lot of attention from the women. But believe me, some of those guys are not getting as much pussy as you may think. It, it's just attention because one thing for sure, if a guy wasn't a chick magnet, before stepping, he's still not a chick man. Just because he dancing and vice versa. I disagree. I disagree. No. There are some very Listen. unattractive guys that they, no, no, no. They, 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 they may be not getting they may be the the attention, right. but they're not getting double the sex that they would get if they went in the They got game. They was no, getting no, all they get no sex at all. So yeah. if they yeah. wouldn't yeah. get no yeah. sex at all yeah. and they got one sex, that's double the sex that they would get. <laughs>
Because and that's your last statement. I, I, I'm married Are you? to the tea lady. You, okay. and, I, and, 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 and I'm going to tell y'all, you this, this is real. Ah. I'm, I'm going to try to be real and, and, and honest with you people out there. Something that can't demand that you quit. do. Tea lady and I know we've made boundaries of what we do and what we don't do on the step of scene. Okay. First thing we do when we come in, we dance together. And we know that other people are wanna go, you know, they, they wanna dance with us. So we dance together, that's the first dance that we do. And then we have certain songs that, okay, this song- That's our song, song. you can't dance that's off that song with nobody else. You can't dance off that song with nobody else. So if somebody come and ask, is she gonna say, uh-uh, so cause he on his way. If you follow that right there, and if you guys come into the stepping scene with those rules, you can't go wrong. I mean, you can't really make it wrong. Don't talk to him yet. Don't talk to him yet. To me. Uh-uh. He missed the stepping song last night. I mean, not a stepping song, a walking song. He was I said, I don't know he went. Oh. He was in the middle because the dance with the walk on the outside, steps on the inside. I dance with him. Uh-uh. I like this right here. Who you dance with? Who you dance with first last night? Oh, that's true. Go ahead, man. Come on. 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 Come Right. Yeah, it was a three-shirt night for him last night for sure. <laughs> um, in my experience, I've been stepping for at least six years. And, um, six. Okay. Just six. Okay. And being a single man, I've been dancing all my life. Okay. And you know, everyone's been in relationships and everything. But the biggest thing that I've noticed, now everybody's here talking about relationships and this and that, but for me, a lot of times, it's all about a hookup. Now, it may be a uh, catch-22, but a lot of these women here like sex just as much as men. It's reality. Do not her. want to re- do not want to acknowledge that because they might, they might think that a whole they might be a whole. Hold on. And I'm gonna tell you now, I've had a lot of poutine thrown at me. He's had a lot of sex. You know what I'm saying? Poutine. I say poutine because we don't want to say it. Don't have to be saying it. Pussy. Pussy. You can't look. I have a lot of people saying it. Don't have to be saying it. Don't have to be saying it. But my big, my thing is this. Because of the fact, like he was saying, there's 14 to 1 as far as women and men. You've got more women throwing it at us than we're trying to get you. Now, what? But we can't But let me tell you this. But with a man, because we are weak and we like that sex, most women are going to say this. You want to give it to me or you get it. You know what I'm saying? Say that again. If a woman comes up to me and she wants to give it to me, I'm like, no, I don't want you. What's wrong with you? You get it? Oh. <laughs> don't lie. Oh, my God. Oh. It ain't like that. But after I got 
got a little older, I kept thinking to myself, I could buy some Timberland. I have got you at 23. I could buy some. Baby, I have got you. I have got you at 23. I have got you, baby. I'm not 23. You would have did shit at 23. Oh, I have got you. I you don't want to be 23. I have got you.